let me start off by saying limited run game sucks. So I've heard this from other people before, but I've never experienced this myself. Um, how they treat a good customer is absolutely awful. Um, I don't recommend limited run games anymore. I won't be buying anything from them anymore. I'm done. This is the last package that I ordered from limited run and it was a disaster. This was ordered, I believe it was January 2nd. Um, this was like the end of the year sale where they were doing like blind boxes and stuff that was in stock at their, at their um, warehouse. This should not have taken this long to get. It is today, July 4th. I've gotten this probably about two weeks ago now, maybe a week and a half. Um, I didn't open it because I wanted to make this video, but I'm done with them. I'm not ordering anything else. I've heard the stories from other people and I finally experienced those things in real life myself and I'm done. I'm done with Limited Run. I've ordered thousands of dollars worth of products from them. And you know what? I have items that have been unordered, uh, that have been ordered for two years now, uh, specifically Worms or Armageddon. I ordered almost two years ago and I still don't have it. Um, and I've ordered it for several different ways. I ordered special editions, collector's editions, just a regular edition, the classic edition. I don't have any of it. Um, this order they messed up. So this was all items that were in stock at their warehouse that should have been delivered fairly with quickly. I would say within even a month. Now, I'm not an online shopper. I don't shop at Amazon. I like to physically shop in stores. A friend of mine brought up a good point that people are used to Amazon. And I said, well, you know what though? I'm not because I don't shop on Amazon. I think in my lifetime, I think I've bought two things off Amazon. One was an electric vehicle charger that I had no choice because that was the only way they sold them. And the other one was the TurboGrafx-16 Mini, which again, that was the only place that you could get TurboGrafx Mini. Um, so my expectations are not to get things in two or three days. Um, I'm very patient. I'll wait a couple months, no problem. But when you screw up by order and you screw up, uh, screw around with emails and when you're going to get something, it makes me want to quit. Um, this order was supposed to be much more than this. This should have included PlayStation 4 blind boxes, um, which they ran out of. How do you run out of something that somebody prepaid for? Um, a DHL tracking number showed up um, in my email, said your item is shipped. Well, three, four, five days go by, I track it, nothing. Finally, about a month goes by, I email Limited Run, very patient. I email them, hey, I never received this package. Okay, three days go by, let me look into it. That's what they, they responded, they're gonna look into it. They look into it, they're gonna resend the items. Another week or two go by. I get another email finally from, or I had to email again, then I get another email from, okay, we no longer have blind boxes in stock and several of the items that you ordered are now no longer in stock. So wait, I paid for something, you accepted the payment, you lost the order, and now nothing, that's it. So no compensation at all, no apology, back and forth, back and forth. All right, can you email me a new tracking number with my items? Yeah, sure. Another couple weeks go by, nothing. I had to open up another case to find out what was going on. Finally, after opening up the second case, my items shipped minus the blind boxes that I originally paid for. Now they did refund me those blind boxes, but you know what, and also the games that I ordered that I couldn't get, um, that they ran out of. But yeah, I'm done with limited run. It's, I'll tell you what, it's gotta be really something special for me to want to order from them. Um, and I have things on order, so there will be some um, other unboxing videos uh, from limited run, but I won't be ordering anymore. I might buy some of their stuff at Best Buy because you can get it at Best Buy. You can actually get them on Amazon too. Um, but I, unless it's something I really, really want, I'm done. So let's see what they did ship me. So lost quite a few items. I don't remember everything. I don't, now some of the items that I ordered, I don't know why I ordered it. I forgot why I ordered this, Tetris Effects. Um, I think I actually already have this. It's just a distribution title and Apparently I ordered it. So <laughs> of course they had that in stock. I wonder on my invoice if there's anything in here that says what I originally ordered. Tetris. 
nope the the stuff that i ordered is in here so i got mercenary kings this looks pretty good um this remind me a lot of metal slug so that's why i ordered this this looks awesome it is limited run number uh 274 so it is one of their their numbered limited run games um yeah this is pretty cool i'm excited to play that this is one that i missed out on um which i ordered uh jay and silent ball uh bob mall brawl arcade edition so who doesn't love jay and silent bob they are awesome love the movies love jay and silent bob and uh this is look cool so got that playstation 4 this i originally wanted for the nintendo switch and um i couldn't find it and the cover bert on this is absolutely ridiculous uh freedom finger um it just looked cool this was another game i wanted on the switch i think i had ordered on the switch and this is one of the other games that got canceled uh but yeah this is a uh, a shoot 'em up looks awesome really bizarre cover art it's limited run number uh 378 and that's the back cover art very very weird game the cover art on the uh, switch version is different I actually like that one better uh but this one's pretty cool I don't, I don't know whose kid that is i'm sure that's somebody's kid uh last thing in here i think is this item right here and this is i think i don't think it's the collector's edition it's the next the edition right in the middle uh, but it's another thing of uh, Jay and Silent Bob's Mall Brawl Arcade Edition. So I'm not going to open this one. This one's going to be for the shelf. I thought it looked cool. And uh, I forgot, is this a PlayStation 4 version or is this an NES cartridge? I don't even remember. I ordered these so long ago that I can't remember. Some of the Action Brawlers of the NES. It's similar to the Action Brawlers, uh, Brawlers of the NES uh like river city ransom and double dragon but is it an nes cartridge i don't remember so i don't know it looks like an nes box which i think is really cool uh but yeah we got that so i'm not gonna open this one i'll open these three or four here and uh yeah guys let me know if you guys had this experience i and i have several other things that i ordered from limited run it's just it's super annoying it's super frustrating and you know what their customer service sucks um, I started ordering things about two years ago from another company um, called Super Rare Games. I definitely recommend them. They're out of Europe. And um, it's crazy because this company, Limited Run, is out in North Carolina. And, you know, now I know the games are – they, what they do is they sell the games before they, they make them or produce them or something. And so that's why you get them months later. And I'm, I'm very patient with that. Super Rare Games, who also is a – uh, limited game company they make one game at a time um they make them and then uh they distribute a new switch game every two weeks and up until recently they only made switch games now they make playstation 4 and 5 games that just started um about a week or two ago um and i think they made their first three games they launched them all at the same time which is pretty cool uh, but they're all all games that are already on the switch they're they're recent releases from the switch so um i get their games from from europe within 10 days of ordering from them so that's pretty impressive and they're usually limited to 2,000 to 4,000 games some games are 5,000 um and I get those games within two weeks at the most uh from ordering it so by the time I order the next game the last game is already here so I don't know limited runs falling apart and you know what their customer service is absolute garbage I'd love to know in the comments below if anyone has experienced this issue I heard many youtubers experience this and I really liked them. I really did. I really tried to support the company. And it's very disappointing. And um, I'm just done with them. You know, it, ordering things, you know, six months, paying for it in full for things that they have in their warehouse should have been mailed within two, three weeks, maybe a month max. And then to order something and not get it at all, to say they ran out of something and have to, me, have to follow up with them to, t to do that and then not get any comp compensation at all, you know, or apology, not acceptable. So I'm done with limited run. Let me guys, let me know what you guys know, uh, think in the comments below. Um, clearly, I'm very upset about this. I did like the company, but I'm done. Let me know what you guys think.